Arsenal under-23s face Derby in an important Premier League two encounter. The Rams on an unbeaten run could go top with victory. However, Arsenal could go up to third. A welcome sight tonight for Gunners fans is club captain Lauren Koscielny making an appearance as he continues his recovery from injury. Bowler. Gilmore. Bowler again. Which just bounced out of his possession, allows Thorne to release Mitchell Lawson. Bowler's back at him again, but takes a tumble, and the referee says penalty. Well, he got himself into a bit of a tangle there. And Bowler's been booked as well for the challenge, and it's a Derby County penalty. George Thorne with the responsibility, and the Gunners are behind. 25th minute, and it is Derby 1. Arsenal nil, and Freddie Lundberg with plenty to ponder in the opening minutes here. Zalalem did well to poke it away, and here's Bramall. Look at the pace of Bramall, he's away, he's got options as well. It's cleared by Wassel, not too far, hit by Coyle, John Jules! And it was blocked for the second time by Callum McDonald, and Arsenal's best moments of the match so far and evidence that they can surely find a way back into this match, trailing by just the goal. Well, I guess it was always likely that Koscielny would go off. I'll say 2-2 on for him at the start of the second half. Now then, Derby looking to build and maybe take advantage as well. And here comes Evans, and on it goes towards Cresswell. And what's that? Three minutes, less than that. And into the second half, we've already seen Arsenal breached. And it's 2-0 Derby. Zelalem, Ole Inca, was he fouled? Referee says no, Thorne brings it away. John Jules with a challenge, I'll say 2-2 with a challenge. Thorne doesn't like the challenge of I'll say 2-2 and it's a little bit of a flare up out of nothing really. I'll say 2-2 and George Thorne and the referee decides that it's a red card for I'll say 2-2 and Arsenal are down to 10 but what's his view on George Thorne? Well he's already been booked and a second yellow sees him go as well. Way by Ballard. Back towards McAllister. Oh, Ballard's missed the ball and caught the man. I think it was more mistimed than malicious, but the referee, who's already brandished two red cars, brandishes another, and the young gunners are down to nine. Here's Mitchell Lawson. 10 v 9. I can't remember the last time I saw three red cards in the same game. Certainly not involving the under-23s, but... The game is over. Knight, the substitute, batters one into the gunner's net. And now it's just about damage limitation. Here is Brown. On it goes towards Mitchell Lawson. He's been a menace all night. He's got the better of Bramall. Arsenal again in disarray. And Sibley, Louis Sibley makes it 4-0. There's still 13 minutes to go. The Gunners just want this to end. Into the second minute of added time. And I'm afraid it'll be one of those evenings that Arsenal will just want to forget and it might just get that little bit worse. It does. Sibley's second, Derby's fifth. So many lessons I'm sure they would have learned tonight but it has been a chastening.